A woman in court today for alleged animal cruelty. She faces charges after more than 100 rabbits, dogs, cats, birds were pulled from her home, many coming from her basement. Colton Molesky has more on this story now at three. 107 rabbits removed from a woman's home over two trips, along with birds, cats, and a dog. All those animals here at the Stark County Humane Society. And we talked with a neighbor who says this isn't the first time police have been at the woman's home. So when I seen them take them out, it was like they had about 50 containers. An agitated April Wolfgang appeared in court today for three counts of prohibitions concerning companion animals, an offense tied to animal cruelty and neglect. Those little spots all out there and all around the side of the house is where she buried a lot of them at. Police reports led us to this address on 7th Street in Canton, where police say they pulled 98 rabbits, 7 cats, 4 birds, and a dog out in April. But it did not end there. She couldn't take care of those animals. That child could barely take care of herself. On Monday, police went back and Wolfgang already had a fresh nine rabbits and five cats. Julia, the neighbor next door, who asked her face not be on camera, says the house emanated a bad smell and it was apparent animals were being held there in poor condition. About a year or so back, they came and they emptied it out a year or two after, before that. This is not the first time. Wolfgang's bond is set at $45,000. And the provision that you're to have no animals during the pendency of this matter. Do you understand that? That'll be all. She's due back in court Friday. She needed help. Mm -hmm. I don't, she's never asked for it or anything, but she needed help. Now the Humane Society wasn't able to comment today, but on a Facebook post that has since been removed, it said that this was the most animals ever collected in a single day. In Canton, Colt Molesky, 19 News.